Hey hello everybody, my name is Gadim and welcome back for another video of Tell Me Why. We're going to continue the series. Uh, right now I think I just have to talk to uh, L. Allison. So let's just go ahead and talk to her. We can look at her. I think we're going to be fine. Let's just talk to her. I think we're about ready to go into the town, head out into the town and get the supplies we need. So I think let's we should do it. head out right away. Already tired of the view? Just finding it hard to relax and enjoy it with so much on my mind. Go ahead. I'll catch up. Need All to right, then. Respond to a message. Uh -huh. My sister, the social butterfly. Let's go, boys. We're heading out. So, I'll see. It's going to be interesting to see what's going to happen in this video. What the what fuck? The fuck? You got what the fuck five is this? seconds to talk me into defending my property. Your property? Your property? Five, We're selling that property. Four, I'm Tyler. Don't know any Tylers. Three, two. Sam. Ellie, what are you doing out, girl? This is our house. Was I talking to you? Sam, put the gun down. This is Tyler, my brother. Your brother? Oh shit. Huh. I guess I heard about all that, but I never. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> you look like a real man. So do you, Sam. You know what I mean. I just didn't know they could make a woman look so much like a man. Well, they can do, uh, there's a lot of stuff they can do nowadays, I guess. A lot of possible things. Well, I'm just me, I guess. You know, just trying to be me. It's just who I am. Hmm. Well, I've seen a couple of lady transvestites on the TV before, but, uh, I don't know. I've never seen a dude. Sam, that's not how you say that. <laughs> say what? What do you mean that's how he says that? He's, the, he's yes. fine with it. That, that's transgender. fine. Transgender. Transgender men. Uh, I'm sorry. It's hard to keep track out here in Devil's Crossing. <laughs> the world's just moving on without us. It's fine. Let's just change the subject. <laughs> Works for me. Tyler. Thanks, Sam. So, what are you doing here exactly? Oh, well, I, uh... I've been kind of keeping an eye on this place for you, you know? Like patching the roof, and checking the pipes, you know, all that stuff. Thank you, Sam. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, that's no big deal. I mean, you know, your mama, she was, uh, she was a special lady. She deserved much better than, you know, uh, what you got. I guess so. Didn't you used to help Mary Ann with repairs and building projects? Oh, yeah. Yeah, seeing as your mama never had a man around, I kind of took it on myself to help her keep this place standing. How antiquated of you. Thanks. I uh, guess you two are still aiming to sell the place? That's the plan. Which, by the way, we need your keys. Since apparently you went and changed the locks? Oh yeah, absolutely. But, uh, selling your mother's house? Are you sure? Bad or good? It's all you've got left of her. Well, we got really no use, real no use for this house in particular, so that's why we're selling it. It's not about our mother. Uh, no one asked you, no, that's just rude. Well, just a few bad memories too, I guess. That's the, the other option was just a way too no, rude to do. I'm sure the gun it's not going to be rude. Still somewhere in there. Tyler! What? What Tyler means is, a fresh start is what we both need. Of course. This place has got to be full of all kinds of bad memories. But maybe some good ones, too. Uh, were you too close? The puzzle, the puzzle on our door? Uh, old to speak using your voice. He's hammered. We should go. No. Were you too close? 
I'm interested in knowing more about this guy. I feel like, you know. How well did you know him? He seems like an interesting guy. Not as well as I thought. When I heard what happened that night, well, I figured people would bullshit me. It really surprised me, didn't it? Much as anything ever happened. Other folks say they saw it coming. <sighs> Not me. What happened exactly? That's uh, that's the thing. I'm kind of interested in knowing what happened. I don't know exactly. Like we don't know yet what happens to her mother. She must have been like crazy. We saw what happened with her shotgun and everything. Eventually, she might have been crazy or something. I don't know. Uh, we should go. He's hammered. You know, we should probably go. We should get going. That's all you think we'll get out of him? Uh, he's too wasted to help us. I have more questions. He's not wasted. What do you mean? Wait. What does he think he's wasted for? I don't feel like he's wasted at all. He's hiding it well if he is. He's too wasted to be of any more help. I'll tell him to get a move on then. Well, we've got a supply run to make in. Uncle Eddie's expecting a visit, so. All right. Yeah, of course. Uh, get going, you two. Um, Sam? We all got to get going. Oh, uh, of course. Of course, yeah, I got lots to do myself. I, lots of to-dos on old Sam's list. And you don't want to keep Brown waiting, you know? <laughs> Thanks for looking out for this place. Happy to do it. I... Uh, don't hesitate to reach out if you need anything. Anything at all. You hear? We won't. No bar no problems, buddy. Sam? We won't hesitate. Huh? Uh Sam? Huh? You're still here. Keys? Yeah. Oh, yeah. What about the keys? You're still here, my guy. Don't yeah, there, don't there go sleeping on the couch now. Uh, you know, this place it meant a lot to your mother. It almost felt like you know, it was a part of her and it's like some part of her is alive here still. Hopefully the house doesn't turn out to be a murderous psycho that tries to kill us in our sleep, huh? Uh, yeah. Well, uh, take care of yourself, uh, both of you. What was that all about, Tyler? Hey, so... I didn't raise you, you really to talk to like that to strangers. Okay, go on. I'll be right behind you. That's not the type of character I want. That's the uh, the the, uh, the opposite side completely. I want Allison to talk like that, not him. Hold on now, what's going on? They did a reverse switch on me already. Double turn, like WWE would say. What's going on here? Let's get a move on already. What are we sticking in the house for? Alright, heading into the town, boys. I feel like that guy, Sam, was pretty a good guy. Uh, kind of a strange man, though. Although he was kind of... I did figure it out. He was wasted, after all. Uh, but, you know. Things tend to happen, I guess. He was a little bit drunk. It was funny, though, seeing him there. He almost fell asleep on the couch. Uh, but I think he's a good man, so... I think we can trust him. And I believe him when he says that if we need anything, we can talk to him so, or ask him or anything. I, I believe him in that sense. I feel like he's a straight dude, boys. Ready to Vreni Vidi Vecchi? I'm ready to talk to Tessa. Just try to keep in mind that your memory of her is 10 years out of date. Yeah, well, it wouldn't be if she reached out to me while I was in Firewheel, which she didn't. She didn't so reach out, huh? Oh, we're playing Allison now. All right, it's time to play Allison. All right. 
Big plan? We're jerks, boys. We're officially a jerk. Let's get in the mood of being a jerk, boys. Let's do it. Alright, so... I want to be optimistic with uh, Tyler. And I want to be a jerk with Allison. Uh, I want to be pessimistic and all that good stuff. Hey, so, hey. let's be a jackass, a jerk, yeah. everything, boys, with yeah. Allison. We're here as patrons. Tyler, meet Michael. This is the annoying co-worker I was telling you about. I was there for your introduction to marshmallow vodka and wine coolers, and I've only worked my way up to annoying co-worker. Rude. <laughs> Don't worry. She told me exactly how miserable she'd be in this town without you. It's so good to finally meet you. The Tyler talk goes on 24-7, so I feel like I already you. Why does it go for uh, forever, uh, though? That's kind of weird. Homestead, or? Yeah, we decided it'd be easiest if we just stayed out there. We'll get it cleaned up faster if we literally cannot escape it. Hey, fuck is Tyler doing? Efficiency. I cannot wait for to get out of here. What's that? Maybe uh gonna be roommates. He wants to move too. Oh, uh Michael is moving to Juno too. Oh, and did you guys plan on moving together or Well, I mean, yeah. It'll be cheaper to share a place, but nothing's set in stone. Makes sense. There could be room for you, too. <laughs> for sure. The more Ronins, the merrier. I'm studying to be a chef, so, uh, you know it'll be good eating. And hey, I only snore during allergy season. And baseball. <laughs> How can I say no to that? <laughs> <sighs> you okay? Dead on my feet, girl. Got up at four to fish before work. It's been a day. Oh, you like to fish? Yeah. There's this spot called Buzzard Hole I go to at least twice a week. It's like an hour drive, but it's so chill. Especially first thing in the morning. Shut up. I used to go there all the time. For real? Yeah. Hey, well, if you want to go sometime, holler at me. I don't mind sharing. Cool. Most guys I know get all Smeagol about their fishing spots. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at you two. Bonding over the most slow and boring to kill an animal. She's just jealous because she couldn't catch a fish. Even if she filled the lake with cyanide I'm first. Not... <sighs> Never mind. Tyler, we better get started with our shopping. Yeah, I'll be around if you need anything. Let's get going already. Stop fucking around, Tyler. I'm interested to see how it's gonna go uh, gameplay-wise with uh, Allison. We got uh, remembering things. It's, it's moving on, boys. Oh, hold on. Yeah, I've got something right here. Memories, boys. If I see some, I'm gonna try to activate them as much as possible. to leave some food for the other customers. But Auntie Tessa said we can have whatever we want. Well, I don't think that's how it works. Man, I miss Tessa's cooking. That's a fond memory that so she has of her, though. What are they called? Fried banana rolls? Saran? Right. Mm, no, I'm pretty sure she made them special for us. So they did a completely... It's going to be hard for me to do the way... Do the gameplay the way I want it. Because the way they did it, they did it the inverted way. Uh, that's why it's a little bit more challenging, a bit more fun for me then, I guess. Because they made Tyler like, uh, they made Tyler the jerk, uh, the one that's pessimistic, and they made Allison the optimistic one. But I want it to be yeah, inverted. I want it to be on the other now, side. I want Allison to be the one that's pessimistic, boy. So uh, we'll see if I can actually turn it around. I do a double turn myself because. Uh, this is not the game's heading a different way that I wanted to heading, uh, head uh, to add. So, we'll see how it goes. I guess. Well, hello, Miss Ronan. Did you forget something in the office? No, just doing some shopping. You remember my brother, Tyler? Your brother? Oh, right, Tyler. Oh, what a pleasant surprise. A pleasant didn't surprise to you too. Tell you I'd be by today. Yes, I think she did. I just didn't expect to see such a dapper young man. <laughs> well, I don't think anybody does over there, but you... Hey, the name is fucking Tyler. What so do you expect you to see? A girl? More or less. We've been working That's out not a girl's time, name. But surprise, surprise. I wonder what his girl name was. Empty, it was missing a few things. Hence the supply run. Ah, right. Well, we'll get you set right up. It must be nice to be home. Uh, I'm not sure nice is the word for it. Oh, of course. I assume being there feels 
complicated. That's one way to describe it. Well, don't let me keep you any longer. I'll be here if you need anything. Oh, hey, is, so is, is this guy there? running for oh, campaign no, or anything? Because he looks like he is. I'm sure, she'll be around later, though. Might be a man important dude to get around our side. Okay. Look at that. So we need Vote for Vecchi Mayor. You want? He's running for mayor. Interesting. Well, that's very interesting. Look at that big ass pumpkin. Holy! How can you go here? That looks uh, ridiculous, boys. I love it though. Let's look at all these. Got some syrup right here, boys. This is when you know you're definitely. Well, we're in Alaska, but we're close to Canada, I guess. Nothing says syrup like Canada. All right. Even though there's a like, well, goddamn uh, American flags everywhere. That pumpkin's huge. It's interesting though because we are in Alaska. It would be interesting to find out if there is still some remaining uh, remains from the Russian Empire over here. Are there still Russian people living here, or is still, or is still uh, vastly unnumbered by the? Um, Americans or the natives in here. I, I would say the natives are the main ones. All these were useless. Let's see what we got. Uh, are you talking to me? How do people eat this? Snob people? Yeah, snob people. Ugh, snob much? It's not that bad. Weren't you the picky eater when we were kids? Whatever. Okay, so uh, what do we... What are we searching for here? We're searching for stuff in particular, or what's going on here? I'm just gonna look at stuff. What is this? Hey Tyler, remember the Trout King? The Trout King? I got a call about a retired trout king. You kidding? He never misses a chance to tell customers he won a trout derby. <laughs> this guy yelling at front. Interesting. I need to talk to this guy. I hope not. It's my colleague, a future uh, uh, co-worker, I guess, or whatever, co-lock, I guess. Water, soda, juice, whatever you want. Oh, so we take everything we need. All right, so what do I take exactly? Do I do this? I'm going to try I'm this one out. Water. I don't even... Oh, that's water? What the hell? Strawberries are no Since bad. when is that water? Okay. I guess water is the best option, really. So we're grabbing water. Is that, uh, does it make a really a difference whether you take something or not? Let's hey, examine Tyler, this. What type of chips, chips do we want? I like that sweet tooth stick. Uh, clay chips. Or what is this? Candies? Candies all day! What do you mean, man? I'm not taking chips over candies. You, you, must, be, uh, you must be joking. Let's see. What about this, Fresh boys? Peonies, triple layer chocolate chip cake. Six pack on the tea light regular. The hell would I take tea for? Holy candle, glacier. Why would I take any of this shit? Tea light regular, six pack on scented. I'm just gonna take the holy candle, I guess. I I guess I don't know, boys. Don't know what the difference is for any of this, but uh, whatever. I'm just taking uh, what makes the most sense for me. So what is this? Boomerang, all surface, all purpose cleaner. Uh, organ, organ key cleaner. What the fuck does that mean? Is that like organic or something? Let's just do the all surface one. Be cheap about it. We don't need to uh, to waste time on that one. Oh, all right. We're done already. We got everything we needed, boys. That was pretty easy. All we needed to do was shopping. I guess it's shopping simulator today, boys. Will that be all? Yes. Thank you, Tom. He says the same thing as me when I'm working. What the hell? Hi, Tessa. We were just meaning to come talk to you. Hi, Tessa. Long time no see. My God, you look like a completely different person. It's me. Plus beard. Yes. How did he do the whole beard thing, though? So That's we kind of. of Wait, hold today. on. That's. Heavens, why would That's the there? next level, ne next level spend. changing right there, though. A you beard? Yeah, I forgot about that part. Just by surprise. Oh, really? Like changing your girl you from a guy about her. is doable. It's definitely doable nowadays. But making a beard—that's something person, else, man. That's that's next level. Hold on, I'm gonna 
I'm going to check up a detail on his face or on part of his things, I know, though. But I need to ask. I need to know for <laughs> sure if they did a good job. Did she ever talk about me being a boy? No. I think they did. It never came up. Hold on, boys. Later, just like We're going to listen to them talking really quick, but I think they did a good job. She really didn't confide in you at all? Your mother was intensely private. She didn't need anyone else, and she made that clear. But this was about Tyra. She was always willing to ask for help when it came to us. Not at the end. Look, I have a lot on my plate today. I am sorry. My advice to you would be to try to move on. It's not that easy. <sighs> what happened that night? You can't understand something like that, but it was God's plan. Oh, okay, then. All we can know. If you say so. Best of luck to you, truly. You just lost me dead uh, there or at the God plan. I told you she wouldn't talk. Except she's got CIA training. Something's weird here. It's weird, right? Yeah, I feel it too. But something's on the tip of my tongue. What's weird? They have a boat. They both have a feeling. But something's weird, but I don't sense anything weird. Did we buy stuff? Can we leave? Why are we le why are we not leaving? Interesting. Let me talk to this guy really quick. What's going on here? I think Tessa is basically becoming a new manager, so she doesn't have time to talk to us, I guess. Ain't nobody have time for this shit. Can I talk to her? Staff only. Oh, examine. What is this? It's another thing we can examine. Look. Nah, I'm not, there's nothing I can take, so I'm not looking. Not wasting time for uh, di dialogues or anything, boys. Let's take a look around here. I'm not. I'm pretty sure we're not supposed Sorry, to be here. Or employees week. only. Open this shit up, man. We're just gonna start stealing shit, Allison? I guess. Oh, uh, no, no thanks. I'm good. No, I'm, I'm good. I'm just gonna steal things really quick. What's this? Let's just take that shit. Here. There we go. We're just taking uh, these are collectibles anyway, so we're just Oh. Man, Tessa keeps track of everything we know of. Like what? All the loans she's given out, the stuff she lets cycle into two fifty three. Even her ties. And then what? She starts passing out some more feds if people don't pay her back. Uh, I think she just likes having a record. She's gonna hand it off to St. Paul like a resume. Interesting boy, so she's got some sort of a uh, record and stuff like that. It's a uh, something for sure. Uh, let's talk to her. Yo, look. What's going on, Tessa? Do you, you don't seem like the same you? person as usual. Uh, just shopping. What are you up to? So what are you doing there? Oh, just inventory. Guess I'm lucky I had the day off, huh? <laughs> yes, not a lucky coincidence. What does that mean? What does that mean? Does that have, does this have something? Okay, I'm never mind. You know, no, never mind. you're gonna be sassy like that. Uh, I don't want to talk to you, girl. The hell was that all about? All right, uh, are we going somewhere in particular, Tyler? Because I don't. Oh, we got a memory thingy. Hold on. Guys, you all done yet? Yeah, mom. Can we go outside while you to play cards? <laughs> I'm afraid there's no time for games today, sweetie. Now let's go. Marianne, can you come here? Sorry, Tessa, I'm in a bit of a hurry. Oh, what's your excuse this time? Emergency repairs for your beaver dam? Tessa, look. No, I don't want to hear it. I want to talk to you now. Or do I need to start calling in your debt? She's a debt collector? I completely wow, Tessa was, uh, Tessa's a big dude, huh? It's a big girl. Here, let's see if we can call she collects debt, boys. Next thing you uh, you know, she's working for the mafia, boys. That's interesting. So that might have something to do with what happened to our mother or something like that, boys. Interesting, right here. Uh, Mom, decide while you and Tessa play cards. No, there's no time for games today. Marianne, can we talk? What's going no. on here, boys? Just leave the groceries, kids. Let's go. Don't. Please, let's just talk for a few minutes. 
Okay. Very strange. She's being basically she's being uh followed by Tessa and Tessa's basically harassing her over the money that she's basically owing her, I guess. Marianne defended us because Tessa got all preachy. Which is it going to be? Yeah, Tessa was kind of weird right there. Tessa doesn't seem like the right girl right here. She seems like uh, she was all over Marianne, my guy. Talk for a few Choose Tyler's memory. Marianne was angry. Choose I Tessa's memory. Uh, Allison's memory. Ta Tessa was angry. No, Tessa was angry. Wait, what's going on here, Tyler? Why are you being a jerk? I want Allison to be the jerk. I'm not gonna have to switch my plans around, boys. I guess so. No, Tessa was definitely angry on that one. It was definitely Tessa who was angry. Not Marianne right there. The Lord disciplines those he loves. Your failure was his, Marianne. Judge me all you want, but don't spew that hate around my children. Spew hate? I am trying to be your friend. They need a firm, guiding hand, and you... Oh my god. You actually think you're being a friend right now? Talking about my children that way? Yes, you might find this hard to believe, but friends aren't just for loans, Marianne. You really want to get into this? Fine. Let's go to your office. I'll be right back, kid. You stay inside, okay? What is wrong with you? Yeah, there we go, boys. That's definitely the memory I would remember. I mean, definitely Tessa is a... Tessa was being a jerk right there. It's not Marianne. I could definitely see it from the beginning. I really don't think Tessa was being that harsh. You don't know her. And regardless of who started things, once they were in the office, they both went at it. What do you think they were arguing about? Me? I don't know. I don't know if they were arguing about you, my guy. But it's hey, just in general, probably. Faces, let's ask her. We're asking her now. We're doing a whole investigation, boys. I like this whole power thing. Gives us memories, investigation. This whole thing is like turning into a Batman game, boys. Interesting. All right, uh, I think we can talk to her now and uh, is there something ask can her. Do for you? Uh, your fight with Marianne. Yeah, what about that? What, what was that all about? Earlier you said Marianne kept everything to herself. But you two had a big fight a few months before her death, didn't you? We argued all the time. You'll have to be more specific. This wasn't about who cheated at Canasta. This was intense. You locked yourselves in the office so we couldn't hear. I'm sorry. It was a long time ago. Now, I was in the middle of something. Okay. What are you want? We'll leave you to it. What are you hiding Jesus. from us? Why are you hiding stuff? I think she knows more than she's letting on. <sighs> but duh. But there's no way to nail her down when we don't even know what we mean. If we could pinpoint what it was about, she'd be out of excuses. Sure, but how do we do that? And the music was too loud to make out what they were saying. Mm. Marianne and Tessa were obsessed with that song. It was on all the time. What are you thinking? We've been getting these visions whenever we see or hear something really emotional. Maybe listening to it will trigger something. Hmm. You may be onto something here, Ronan. We can't go back to her with anything half-assed. We should go talk to Tom. Make sure we build as strong of a case as possible. Okay. We're building a case now. We can figure out what song it was. Now we're just we're officially investigators, boys. That's kind of crazy. We're going all in on this uh, on this uh, thing. Uh, remember that one song, my guy. This might be a weird question, but do you remember the song that Tessa and Marianne used to love? They played it all the time. <laughs> How could I forget? Uh, I think she's still got the CD back here. Oh, hold on, no, don't play it. Don't play it. I'm gonna get copyrighted. Don't do it, my guy. I ain't about that life right now. Huh, here it is. I was oh, here it goes, boys. Away, to be no money for me today. For my tastes. Copyright time.
I can't even hear the music. I probably lowered the music all the way down. That's so weird. That's gonna be awkward, boys. This is it, right? I think so. Are we getting some memories out of that? <laughs> oh, I think we do. We're having some memories, boys, popping up. Whoa, I just got hit with a flood of memories. You seen what I'm seeing? Yeah. You do know Tom can probably hear you, my guy, when you saying that. Imagine Tom hearing them and then uh, saying like, what the hell are they talking about, you know? Some of us are actually trying to get work done here. Interesting. So Tessa, okay. Yeah. What the hell happened? What the hell happened? Stress and uh, stress and over uh, overall uh, d work or overall life, I guess, happened to her. The kids keep pestering me for these candies. They're so expensive. I'll just grab a bag. Oh no, I, I can't, Tessa. It's nothing. Okay. Oh, is this where it all started? It your little notebook. Okay, okay, whatever you want. There, happy? Yes. And oh I no, this is where it started, huh? She keeps no, counting. It. She keeps the count. What a bitch! I'm gonna say it, boys. Tessa's a B. She kept counting, ca counting count after that. She's a B for sure. Okay, so we got some more memories. Uh, do we have uh, more right here that we uh, we can? Oh, I'm uh, I'm I'm getting something right here. It's vibrating, boys. Oh, there it is. Found it, boys. What are you doing here? Uh, I thought you needed help. It was. I needed help two hours ago. Have you been drinking? What? What's no, wrong with you, Tessa? Good day, okay? I took a pill. I'm fine. Marianne. I said I'm fine. Kids, come on, let's go. Wait, please. I have something for you. Take a look at this when you get home, okay? They can handle this confusion. I've been working with these people for years. They can help. So Tessa gave her the pamphlet. Tessa being a very religious, obviously, is not going to allow Tyler to do his thing. Well, don't we have some hard proof, though, already? So do we need to talk to Marianne again? Or not Marianne, but uh, Tessa? For the, about those ten, uh, the, these pamphlets, boys? Maybe we do. It's turning into a whole investigation right here. Switch it on. Lisa, is it okay if I run a quick Google search? My phone's dead. Sure, but make it quick. I'm going to need the computer. Urgent, don't miss out this opportunity. What if I told you the government owed you up to 10,000 cash? Interesting. She's doing loans, huh? All right. And uh, hello, your orders has been shipped. Tessa, all right. I got back from my work. Interesting. So scroll. A bunch of stuff right here. And Barbara, the elephant in the room. I know you y'all don't have this time for conversation, but Lisa has flagged on rehearsals again. Ah, there we go. So now we got. Now we can look at that. So uh, turn that on. So read that. June, 24 bucks for meal at the restaurant paid off. Uh, $11, doll for the kid. Doll for the kid, okay. Elijah, let's turn that shit. What's that? Uh, wh which one is that? Eric B, that's paid off. Someone got paid the right way. Okay, no Marianne, there it is. It looks like Marianne April, 50, that's paid off. Paid off, paid off, paid off. 
140 bucks for washing machine repairs, no show. 55 bucks, check bounced. New shoes for the kids, boys, okay. No show again on December and no show on January. She, she stopped um, she stopped paying and that obviously uh, probably something happened to her after that. Uh, the reason why she disappeared or died has something to do with Tessa. I gotta tell you, uh, obviously T Tessa's keeping work uh, record of the money. Okay, let's go talk to her. Let's find out right here. She's keeping a record and everything. Yeah, he's got a good sense of Is there something I can do for you? It's like mafia style right here. You remember the few details. We're back. With details that should help your memory. Oh, really? Yes, really. We were buying groceries, and then you, you stormed in, threatening to call in debts and demanding that Marianne talk to you. It turned into an argument. So you guys went into the office, blasted that song you used to dance to all the time. Call in debts? I never. Like I'm some kind of loan shark. When did this supposedly occur? Well, our memories don't exactly have timestamps. I can't be expected to take these accusations seriously if you can't even recall basic details. October 24th, August. Uh, it wasn't August. It wasn't. I think it's October. It's October 24th. Yeah. October 2004. That was when she stopped trying to pay her debts, right? Yes. I don't know why. She always found a way to pay before that. But we never argued about money. I, I was frustrated, but you can't squeeze blood from a stone. Yeah, we didn't think you guys were arguing about money. You were mad she bailed on you? You told her about the cap? You said you, yeah, you said she was flailing us. That's pretty much what the argument was all about, wasn't it? You said she was failing us and called her a bad parent. Was she done being judged by you? Was that it? I really have no idea what you're talking about. And I was never cruel to Marianne. I did everything I could to help her. To help you all. Even when she fought me. Even when she screamed and spit in my face for the effort. Even when she, even when she didn't deserve it. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Calm down. Look. We know you took care of us. And we're grateful. I really need you to answer one question. When you two fought, was it ever about me? It was always about a lot of things. She was struggling with everything at the end. Did you try to convince Marianne to send Tyler to some kind of program? No, and I think you should go now. Tessa, I'm here to figure out if Marianne tried to kill me because of who I am. Do you get that? I do, I just... Then why won't you give us a straight answer? <laughs> I truly don't know what went on in her mind that day. And it will always be my deepest regret that I didn't see it coming. Now I understand that this is an emotional topic for you both. And fortunately for you, I keep forgiveness at the heart of my relationships. You're so fucking righteous. Why did you dump Marianne when she was at her worst? I will not be dragged back into this. You need to go. Now. Do we have our groceries? Uh... Um, Michael already put them in your trunk. Cool. Bye, Tom. What do you think? Well, that went well. I'm trying to wrap my brain around all that. You know, we might have actually gotten to the truth if you hadn't lashed out at her. That's worked out for me. Right I like Allison lashing out. Time. That's exactly Don't what I want her to do. Me. It's obvious she's guilty of something, and that's why she doesn't want to talk about it. Oh, that sanctimonious bitch! Damn! Chill, yeah, Allison, chill. <sighs> Sorry, I got so worked up. <laughs> you got worked up, all right. She, dumb like that. she knows how important this is to us, to you. Yeah, but you know, you're onto something with the guilt. She didn't want to admit what they fought about, which makes me think it was me. You spooked her with that talk about the program. I think... Marianne really was trying to figure out how to support me before whatever the hell happened that pushed her over the edge. You may be right. Yeah. She stood up for me, Allison. She was still crazy Marianne, but she saw me. I feel lighter. You do, huh? Like I've been carrying That's good to know. around for the last 10 years and now it's 
on. I, I'm really happy for you. I am. That just opens a whole new box of Pandoras, doesn't it? Let's close it then. Yeah, a whole damn shipping crate full. Let's find out what happened and close it. We're going to figure out what happened to our mother, boys. That's as simple as that. Good thing Eddie's expecting us. He knew Marianne pretty well, and he was in charge of her case. Did he ever mention anything about the investigation to you? No, I never asked. And I'm sure he thought I was better off not knowing. I guess that might have made for some awkward dinner conversation. Exactly. But, I mean, he's a good cop. Thorough. I'm sure he's got something. So we're going after a cop right here. It's funny because we're actually doing our own little investigation as if we were detectives and stuff. Like, this is not our job. This is, we shouldn't do that. We should ask for the cops in particular to do that uh, sort of job. That's their job to do that, investigate. I don't know, call the CIA, call the FBI, whatever you want. Call anybody, but don't do it yourself. You know, that's not this your job. Kind of bleak. And you could be in danger of doing crowded. stuff like that. Uh, whatever, I guess. <laughs> There's no crime after six? In the mean streets of Delos Crossing? Just bears and drunken disorderlies. And Uncle Eddie can usually handle them on his own. What a hero. Anyway, he's probably in his office upstairs. Alrighty then. Ryan, boys. Can I can I switch or yeah. is it I don't think I see switch characters. I think off. you don't have a choice really. So old call hero? This thing scares the kids. Yeah, I keep telling Eddie to get rid of it. He terrifies all the kids that come through here. Alright, so please a uh, walk in line. Thank you very much. Alright, so what is home this? We got a bunch of stuff. We got a heater down there. Yeah, Why? I, I don't know. The whole precinct's basically family. Hmm. Examine. We've got a bunch of stuff we can examine right here. here. Let's look Do at that picture. Shelby? I think so. The high schoolers who are always pissing Tessa off because they would blast fish and make out in the Vecchi parking lot. Yep. Dan's a cop now. They're married and have a kid, a dog, the whole shebang. Damn. When did everybody decide to become an adult? Good for him. He has a boring life, I guess, boys. Good for him. Let's see what we got right here. More stuff. We got some memories. I'm getting some memories, but before I hold on to that, we got some more stuff we can examine. That's Denise Wilson's desk. Remember her? Uh, crazy D? The woman who set fire to her ex's trailer? Allegedly set fire. She was acquitted. And that's Officer Wilson. So we, uh, we can write, leave a note, uh, draw a dog. Just leave a note. We're going to leave her a note. You never know, right? If we leave a note, maybe um, they're going to be able to help us out. It could really be helpful, you know. Take a look at the note. Hi, Denise. Thanks for helping replace my tires. Ah, there we go. Not going to freak her out. Look at that dog she has. That's beautiful. Let's look, uh, take a look around, boys, everywhere. All the little stuff. What Ooh, is this? That is going to smell lovely tomorrow. It's from Tessa's restaurant, right? Uh-huh. Everyone eats there all the time. It's as exciting as food gets in Delos Crossing. Hey, it's all good, man. If it's good food, you take it. Let's take a look really quick. Do we have anything in here? Why do I have a feeling I'm going to get jump scared if I look too often? I'm not going to do that, boys. Okay, so do we have... I have a memory. Like, I can, I can literally see it. Remember, there we go. We got the memory right here. Come on, man. We can't make these poor kids sleep here. Well, where do you suggest they go? Social services will be here in a few hours, and this is the only room with a bed. Anywhere but her cell. We'll find some other place. What was that? How do we met? Here we go again. God, I'm not here too. I'm not ready. Me neither. How the hell did we manage to get a memory of a cop? That's kind of weird, boys. We weren't there, so how do we manage to... That's kind of uh, interesting. Let's examine all of this. What is all this? 
Uh, look at the Darren, pictures, really. Stop touching everything, Butterfingers. Sorry. <laughs> this guy's out here touching everything. Come on, Tyler. Okay, let's get out of here. I don't think we have anything, really. There's a radio down here. We're not going to mess around with anything uh, particular. I am doing a longer, uh, a bit longer videos. Because I'm, uh, I'm noticing that this game is probably going to take a while to finish, boys. And uh, I've got another game coming uh, recently, uh, soon enough, away. which is going to be the Avengers game. So I'm going to do longer videos for Tyler, these. You coming? All right, let's see what we got right here, boys. Another box, or that's just journals? Okay, it's newspaper, I guess. We got nothing so far. I mean, uh, nothing that's out of the ordinary. He might be in here. Uh, just getting all the guns and stuff. Uh, let me see. You should stay away. Uh, it's the armory. Yeah, you should stay away. Yep. But I don't need to tell you that it's off limits. You think you could find some files about Marianne in the archives? Well, I don't. Uh, I don't think so. Archives are off limits. I don't think so. No, actually, they're off limits. I don't know. I, it's off limits anyway. Maybe Eddie would show us her file? He could. He could do it. Uh, we can knock at his door. Let's do it. Allison, hey. Just finishing up a call. Trying to convince Melinda the Ravens and her garbage on police business. Give me a few minutes. <laughs> sure. Make yourselves a cup of coffee. Here's the key to the break room. Thanks. Come back upstairs when you're done, okay? All right, then. Coffee sound good? The machine is in the break room downstairs. Uh-huh. I'm not making coffee. Ain't nobody drinking coffee today, my girl. I'm not about to uh, ruin your entire body because of coffee. That's not going to happen. We got some keys, though. I don't know what these are good for. But maybe... You know what? Oh, we can remember something. Hold on. Another thing. Let's remember everything. So this is the guy. We went in there with him. So, oh, is this when she died? Probably open. Oh, hold on. We didn't see that before. I wasn't there. Wait, that's not what we we're looking at? I thought it was the folder or something. Oh. We got a key right here. Looks like she forgot her locker key here. Hey, can we not take it? She's gonna give me so much crap for forgetting her birthday. Turn it, turn it around. Read it. Happy birthday. Okay, interesting. So it doesn't look like I can take her key. I would have thought you would have thought, man, uh, that I could have taken the key, but I guess not. Already have the cop did though. A chief, the chief gave us the key or something. No, we can't go inside here. Doing the whole investigation ourselves. We're just gonna sit down in here, and I'm gonna ask you a few questions, okay? Okay. I'm really curious to know what Tyler's name was when he was a kid. Obviously, he was a girl. So, what the hell was his real name? Yeah. I mean, Tyler's not a girl's name, so. Not to remember that night when he I definitely changed it. What was his original name? I'm really curious, boys. Or what? Uh, what about this place? Okay, let's go in. Anything in particular down here? We got the locker. Of course. Can we open this up? I've got the key. Yep, it's locked. It's locked. Yeah, well, I know where the key is. Yes, but. I guess so. Let's uh, let's read. Any information we can get will so be good. Leaves her locker key in her desk and her password reminder in her locker. That's so irresponsible. An intruder could easily access all kinds of police files with this. Yeah, like two goblin intruders. Like two goblin intruders, exactly. She's making it easy for us. So the password: winner on my birth, the twenty-first birthday. Now, one thing that is for sure. Can probably open this up for the reception. Uh, we got a, we got a, 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 a password or something, so we can probably. It's probably this. It's probably the password for this. 
uh, sve kada je to, the memo, um, date, all police department, new image, please reset your password with the introduction, okay, talk to Sally, okay, interesting, so Rosie, uh, let's talk a uh, user, Jackson, so the password, uh, we need to fi find out what her password is, uh, which one was that? Jackson, it wasn't Vinci, uh, Vinci Zia. Which one was that? Hold on. We got to figure out uh, which user was that. All right. I think it's one of these boys. I think that's the password probably. Uh, winner's list, right? So it's either tip with 2P, tread, socks, or solemn. Let's try it out. Let's try it out, right? So let's go for tip. Uh, let me see real quick, though. I examine really quick. Uh, uh, okay, so tip tread like this and socks and solemn okay uh, okay so i got it so i gotta keep it in mind boys tip a tread socks or solemn let's try uh figure out uh what it is all right boys apparently i'm a dumbass i just looked it up uh what was the password because i spent around 30 minutes trying to figure it out i actually got it right the first time around it was solemn i just didn't write it properly so let me go back there I pressed on the Y instead of the L. I thought it was minuscule instead of majuscule, boys. Uh, I, I didn't. I didn't think it was on cast. I. I, I went. Basically, I went uh, Pepega style. I thought it was. It wasn't on caps. It's on caps. So that's why. Instead of pressing uh, L for the Salem, uh, I went and pressed the wrong one, boys. So we got it. We finally, we're finally in. My God, man, this took forever for me to figure it out. I, I knew I, I was right the first time around. I just didn't press the right, the right one. God damn it! All right, Sam Kensky. Uh, D just asked you since you're picking up the relief shifts tomorrow. There we go. Blah blah blah. That's basically garbage. Lost and found some set of keys, Mr. Reynolds. Okay. Uh, hello, Gregs. Thank you for shopping with us. Nothing. Uh, D scroll. Got a bunch of stuff right here. You guys can read all of this if you want. All right. Uh, police lecture at youth. Okay. Send you some slides. And what about this? So, girl, you're preaching to the core. Looking forward to Friday. When I dare to be powerful to use my strength. Okay. So that does do. Is that does does that do anything in particular? All right, boys, so there wasn't really anything to it. So all I did this, I just wasted 30 minutes of my time, uh, I guess, for an achievement, uh, basically, because I got an achievement out of that. But that's all it is, just for an achievement. I'm going to end the video right here, though, because I just spent so much time uh, for nothing right there. I'm kind of pissed off, and it's time time spent right here. So remember to leave a like and subscribe to the digital video. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.